Hello friends welcome back now we we know that we want to store the uh, latest movies post ids into the database or uh, into the uh, transient data so we will just check whether it's empty and if it's not added then we will make a wp query so like to make a database query and we will fetch uh, the latest five movies post by the genre term uh, past and then we will get the latest movie and do a set transient function here okay so in the set transient function we have to pass transient name our transient data and the expiry time okay i am using this hour in second so these are the time constant introduced in a wordpress um i think in the 3.5 version yeah in the 3.5 version so generally we use uh, 60 into the, like we do a mathematical equations to get the uh, get a given time into the seconds right so wordpress has provided this constant which we can use like minute in seconds hour in seconds day week month and year and we can use it so i have used hour in seconds so be, like for example i want to store this transient for uh, four hours okay so i'm using four into the hour in seconds okay uh, and this set transient function has these three uh experience okay and this transient data will stored into the database or the options table okay and then i'm just returning the latest movie so next time if the same function have been called it will check whether the transient data is there if it exists and if it's not expired then return it else if it's empty then we will uh, make a database query fetch the latest data set the transient data and then return the data okay so this way we can uh, save uh, frequent database api calls um, uh, through by using the transient API okay so how it looks like so if we go to the uh, f uh, function definition so get transient data okay so let me just go through first the set transient data because first we have to set the transient so it will just make sure uh, they also provide apply filter pre set transient so if you want to return some specific then you can simply return the value okay and uh, there are some expiry time also you can uh, filter through this filter expiration of transient and then transient name okay so that and here they had a condition whether object as external object as say it's installed okay or it's wp installing in that case they will set uh, use the wp case set thanks for watching see you on the next one jai wordpress